Hello, this is Africa. Welcome back to This is Africa. And today I will take you to Dar es Salaam in Tanzania to look at Dar es Salaam bus rapid transit, which is a Dar es Salaam BRT. Uh, this is something that uh, we are trying to build in Kenya, so I thought it would be important for me to take you there so that you can see for yourself how this system works. Dar es Salaam bus rapid transit is a bus rapid transit system that did begin operation on 10th of May in the year 2016 in the economical capital of Tanzania, Dar es Salaam, which is also the former capital of Tanzania and the largest Swahili-speaking city in the world. And Dar es Salaam is also the largest city in East Africa. So when you talk about uh, Dar es Salaam BRT, we have to know that it consists of six phases and we have to also know that the construction of the first phase did begin in April in the year 2012 by the Austrian construction company Strabag International GmbH. So after a total of 134 million euros was spent, the first phase was completed in December 2015 and the project was funded by African Development Bank, World Bank and the government of Tanzania. So I'm going to start my journey by going to show you how the system work i will first go to board the bus in kituo chapuzamani chaposta bus station which is located in dar es salaam close to where you take ferries to zanzibar so guys this is the this is how the BRT station in dar es salaam this is uh kituo chazamani a poster looks like and I just uh, bought my ticket here ticket is standard for all stage it is a uh, 650 Tanzania shillings so guys 650 Tanzania shillings is approximately that uh, between that to that five ten, Kenya shillings. So a total of 140 Golden Dragon buses do provide express and local services for 18 hours daily and the services start from 5 a.m. in the morning until 11 p.m. And as I understand, up to now, the BRT flat size has increased to 210. So this particular BRT was heading to an area called Morocco in Dar es Salaam. So the areas that the best are servicing are indicated on the screen of every bus so that people can know where they're heading. So for you, you have to buy a ticket at a 650 Tanzanian shillings which is equivalent to between 30 to 35 Kenya shillings. And by the way, this is a relatively high compared to the local buses which do offer the same services in the city, which do charge 400 Tanzanian shillings and 200 shillings for the students. I don't think the student do pay in BRT station. I did not confirm, but I did not see any of them holding the ticket. So it might be free for them. So if you're from Tanzania, kindly confirm for us so that we can know. So guys, this is one of the best system for providing transport system I have ever seen. And what I can tell you is that uh, this BRT station do look very modern and they are well maintained. Guys, I used to live in Doha in Qatar and I can tell you their bus station is not even close to what Dar es Salaam has. So it is estimated that people who ride this bus are more than 179,000 daily. This is a that's a lot. So, guys, a total of six phases will be operational. Uh, the first one, which is already completed, will be from Kimara to Kawawa, north to Msibazi Street, heading to Kivukoni, uh, which has a total length of 20.9 kilometers. The second phase will be from Kilwa to Kivukoni plus Kawawa south to Kilwa Road, which will have a total length of 19.3 kilometers. There'll be another phase, which is phase three, which will be from airport 
to Uhuru Street along Nyerere Road and it will have a total length of 23.6 kilometers. Phase 4 will be along Bagamoya Road and Sam Nujoma Road which will have a total length of 16.1 kilometers. Phase 5 will be along Madeira Road which will be 22.8 kilometers and the final phase will be along Old Bagamoya Road and uh, it, will be, it will be having a total length of 27.6 kilometers. So we are just coming from Kituo Chabasi Kanesani. And what I have noticed is that the ticket is valid for only 30 minutes. And it will indicate the body point. So guys, at the moment I'm heading toward the CBD and I have decided to walk uh, and whenever I feel like uh, boarding the bus, I will just take uh, one of these, one of uh, this BRT because I just love how organized they are and you can see no, uh, from what I have witnessed is that we are such a well-organized well buses and I do wish that uh, in Nairobi we can have this type of uh, this kind of uh, buses and uh, that type of system So guys, I do hope that you have enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe, like and share my videos. Feel free to comment and I will see you in the next video.